Hello everyone, welcome to Tricks for Maths. This is Sharda Hegde. In this video, we are learning square root by long division method. I hope you have seen other videos on square root itself. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and find the videos in my channel. So, directly we will move to some problems regarding square root by long division method. As a first problem, I am taking here 3249. There are four digits. First step is we need to make group of two two digits. Okay, starting from right hand side. That is 49 one group and 32 is one more group. So, the next step is division we will follow here. First, you will consider the first group, 32. You need to find out the nearest perfect square for this group. That is for 32, the nearest perfect square is 25. We will take not 36 because it exceeds 32. So, the previous perfect square only we will consider. So, for 25, the square root is 5. That 5 we will take here, okay, as a divisor and 5 fives are is 25 below 32 you will write then 32 minus 25 as usual we will do that is 7 now the next group 49 you will take 749 so what will be the next divisor to divide 749 for that you will add these two 5 and 5 that is 10 5 plus 5 you will do and one more digit will be here okay in order to find that you need to concentrate on the unit place of this dividend here it is 9 so in order to get 9 either you will go for 3 3's are that you will get 9 or 7 7's are you will get 9 that means 49 so the unit place is 9 so we can try either 3 or 7 let me go for 3 first okay if I take 3 here I should take 3 here only 3 3 is a 9 ok then 3 0 0 and 3 1 3 it is much less than 749 so I will not consider this I will go for 7 so if I take 7 here I need to write 7 7 za, ok 7 7 both the sides 7 7 za is 49 4 is carry over 7 0 0 so 4 the carry over comes here and 7 1 za, 7 so exactly 749 we got 9 so the answer is 0 0 0 here 9 minus 9 4 minus 4 and 7 minus 7 so our quotient is here 57 this is the square root of 3249 so how we can write square root of 3249 is 57 very easily we can find out let us go for one more example in this example we got four digits let us make group of two first and the second step is division okay we will consider 51 the nearest perfect square for 51 is yes 49 so the root we will consider 7 7 7 is a 49 now subtraction it will be 2 51 minus 49 is 2 and that 84 comes here and next 7 plus 7 is 14 the very next number in order to find this we need to consider the unit place here 4 in order to get 4 either we will go for 2 2 is a 4 or 8 8 is a is 64 right so either we can go for 2 or 8 let me consider 2 only 2 2 is a 4 Again, 2 4s are 8 and then 2 1s are 2. Exactly, I am getting 284. So, the, my quotient is 72 which is the square root of 5184. Square root of 5184 is 72. Let us go for any 5 digit number now. 15,376 we have taken. First, we need to make groups of 2. Here, three groups, two groups are with two digits and one group is with one digit. Now, we will go for division. First, we will consider a single group. One, one's are one, easily we can write, okay. That is, 
0 1 plus 1 is 2 now the next step is but one more digit will be here the next group is 53 I will take for 53 which number you are going to do see if you take 1 21 ones are 21 you will write if you take 2 22 twos are 44 okay rather than taking 21 44 is nearer to 53 so we will go for twos are 2 2's are 4 and 2 2's are 4. So, 13 minus 4 is 9. 4 minus 4 is 0. The next group is 76. I am taking 76 here. Now, 22 plus 2 is 24. There will be one more digit. In order to find that, 6 is in unit place. So, in order to get 6 here, either I can go for 4 4's are 16 or 6 6 are 36 that means I can select 4 or 6 now let me consider 4 if I take 4 here 4 4 is a 16 1 is carry over again 4 4 is a 16 plus 1 is 7 okay then 1 is carry over 4 2 is a 8 plus 1 is 9 so 9 76 I got here my quotient is 124 that means my answer that is square root of 15,376 is 124. Very easily we can write the square root of any perfect square using long division method. I will repeat the step once again. First we will make the group of 2 from right hand side for the given number and then start with the first group. Find the nearest perfect square for that go for division by taking the same quotient okay same quotient and divisor and you will subtract and you will add the divisor and quotient and you will write here and the, for the very next digit you can take the help of the unit place by considering the unit place you will find out the next digit and you will go for the division the process repeats I hope you like the video, you like the method of solving the problem. Please subscribe my channel to get such type of videos. I will meet you in the next video with the more information. Till then take care. Bye bye.